Hey guys, I just wanted to do a quick little video on um, some of the um, products that I've been really enjoying recently and I wanted to show you. This is my makeup. It's right now 8 o'clock and this is my makeup from, I'm not kidding you, 7.20 a.m. this morning. This is the same makeup. The lips I've had to redo and throughout the day my um, I used the BB cream from Maybelline, the Dream Fresh BB Balm beauty balm and I use this to cover some of the imperfections I have rosacea in my skin so you'll in the morning you'll see a lot of red cheeks rash cheeks red over here a lot of red over here over here I just get on my t-zone tons of red in the morning so it's a little pink right now but I just touched it up with a little of this and it seems to cover up most of my color like my hyperpigmentation in my skin the redness in my skin it it really seems to help it a lot big time so I've really been enjoying this a lot and this is my brand new bottle it's my second two because um, I'm just I've got a little left in my first bottle but it's almost gone so I had to go and pick up another one because it, it just works for me I'm not gonna say it works for everyone but for me and my skin it works perfect now this lip color I have right now this is um, this is actually this product here this is the L'Oreal color riche in the Carice line and this is cherry tuli I think it's pronounced cherry tool or cherry tuli I'm not sure but this is my favorite product I got this on clearance at Walgreens for $5.49 because they were discontinuing them to come up with the new um, L'Oreal um, uh, pop bombs pop bombs and um, I got one last week and they smell funky they're they're really horrible this I like better and look how pretty this is it gives you the moisture it gives you the tint you want it's very much a cherry color I am in love with this thing absolutely love it it's perfect um, next I have um, the eyeshadow I'm wearing this is actually my brand new um, Stila palette it's um, in the light I really love this palette. I used to use a lot of drugstore makeup and actually since I started going to more higher end, I can see the difference. It lasts all day. I mean, it's perfect and you use less product. It's yes, it's it's less um, powdery. It's it, it just applies better. I'm going to show you this palette really close up because it's unbelievable. Look how pretty that is. I mean, it is so unbelievably gorgeous. I love it. I've been using this color for my my full lid. It's called Kitten. And then today I went ahead, I did kitten first, then I applied, I wanted to do a different color, so I did this color down there, which is like a, a brownish, grayish, taupey color. It's called Luster. So I used Luster today on my crease, and then what I did was I blended it in really well on my crease, and then on the V of my eye, I went ahead and I did... No, Sunset was on my crease, and then this was on the outer V. And I blended all of it really well, and then on top of the eyelid, I went and did a little bit more Sunset. It just, I don't know, it blended really well. The other day, I used the Night Sky with the Kitten and with some of the Sunset. And you just can get, you can achieve so many different looks from, from this palette alone. And it's actually, I was... I had a 20% coupon off for Ulta, and I was going to get the Naked 3 palette because I like all the peaches and um, rose-toned hues, earthy tones that were in that palette. But it just felt a little powdery to me, a little um, chalky. And as I was walking around, I came around the Stila section, and I was testing it, and I, I just fell in love. They have several other palettes um, in the garden, in the moment, things like that. Um, but this one, just this is their nude palette and the more natural palette. It's buttery. It's so buttery when you touch the, the powders at your finger and they just apply like a dream and they blend so easily. I'm, I'm in love with this. I wouldn't get the other palettes from Stila because I really didn't like the colors. Um, but I'm glad I got the one I really wanted, which is the In the Light. Then I, for my blush, I use my absolute to go to blush, my Milani Bake Blush in Luminoso. Luminoso is so perfect. It almost makes your um, your cheeks look like they were sun-kissed. Um, like you got some color on your cheeks, but you weren't in the sun. And in the summer in Florida, I stay out of the sun. It's I hate it. <laughs> but see how pretty that is? Oh my gosh, I love Luminoso. I'm going to just 
swatch it on my finger. Look how pretty that is. And I could just put a little there and just blend, 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 blend. Of course, I used to prefer my blush brush. Blend, blend, blend. Look how pretty. That's so pretty. I love Luminoso. This is like my favorite shade from Milani, the baked blushes. It looks very natural. I wish I could blend it more. I shouldn't have used my finger. Now I look kind of orangey there. But my point is, it, it, they're pigmented. They're really pigmented and they work really well. I have a brush here. I'll just kind of blend it in. Blend it in as much as I can. That's better already. I absolutely love Luminoso. It is my favorite shade from these baked blushes from Milani. I love this so much I had to try another one of these shimmery ones. And this one is called Dolce Pink. I have Delicioso Pink too, but it's more of a matte finish. And it's brighter pink. I didn't like that one, but I like these shimmery ones. This has like a bit of a bronzer built in it. And this is Dolce Pink. And then the other one is Luminoso, which I love. So I really love these Milani shadows. They're great. Um, then my my bronzer I have the chocolate soleil from Too Faced but it's a bit too dark I don't like it but I have this one which is from Rimmel and this one was discontinued already this is was their sun shimmer and this is in sun love I have to show you when I apply this it looks like it's like the prettiest milk chocolate color like I want to get the milk chocolate soleil from Too Faced but I already have something similar, which this is a great dupe for it. I love it. I'm going to swatch it on my finger. Look how pretty that is. It's like milk chocolate. It's a light bronzer. It's super pretty. It's not too orangey. And if you're light skinned, it would look great on you too. And I'm a little bit tanner, so I'm, I'm definitely olive skin toned. And this is perfect for my skin tone. I love it. It's, it's light. It's not too much bronzer. This has been discontinued, and I got this for $2.90, and this is when I first started using bronzer, and I wanted to try one out without committing too much, and for two ninety, dollars I could, I could get this, and if I hated it, I could toss it out, and it wouldn't, it wouldn't burn a hole in my pocket, but I, I love this, and this will last me forever. Look how huge that palette is. It's huge, but I love it. Another thing I've been enjoying is my Too Faced palettes that I have. This is the Natural Eyes palette. And before I got the steel, I was using this one like every day. Look how pretty that is. I love this color up here. It's called Heaven. But the one I love the most is Silk Teddy, which is that middle big one. That is the prettiest color ever. It gives me the best looks. And I just love this palette. And they're creamy. They're buttery. They're just perfect shadows for your eye. And they last all day. Honestly, the Stila works better. But I love this Too Faced palette. Then they came out with the, their limited edition summer palette, which is called A La Mode Eyes, and I love it. So I was using this in the beginning of the summer. Summer has faded in a little bit more, and I went back to my nudes, but when, for when I first got this, I was using this. Love this palette. That pink is not hot pink when you put it on your eye, and you blend it out. It's more like a strawberry milkshake shade. Very beautiful, very subtle. Every single shade in here is subtle. They're, they're beautiful. They're, it, this palette is perfect for the summer. It's a quintessential summer palette. It's um, the best palette I can say for the summer. Um, I'm also a subscriber to Ipsy. So you get to try out Deluxe um, or like drugstore brand products. And for the July bag, they sent me a Pure Minerals <laughs> Mascara. It's the waterproof formula for the big look. It has argan oil. I got this. I tried it. I've been using it every single day since I got it for the last three weeks. I've been using this. I'm in love with this this mascara. I'm so in love with it. It leaves my eyes perfect. My 